the single biggest blocker of creativity. It's that insidious force that strips us of our best thinking. So first thing I recommend leaders do, and one of the most important things, is to build a culture that supports fresh ideas rather than punishes them. And if we can create cultures that are... Um, that, that allow people to express themselves, both the good and bad ideas, because they're not only going to be good ideas, uh, we create a far stronger organization. Um, how we overcome the fear is, w one thing that's, that's practical if you are really in a fear-based environment is, um, is put some walls around it. In other words, people are often willing to take an experiment or do a prototype as opposed to do, making adopting wide sweeping change. So if you can characterize an idea as an experiment, uh, a lot of times uh, leaders are willing to give a little bit more, org um, a little more leeway, latitude uh, in pursuing that idea. But the most important thing is, even if it's in a small team, if you can get into the groove of celebrating and and, and uh, enjoying each other's ideas instead of punishing it, it makes a huge difference.